Social Way is a WordPress solution based on most popular and time-tested plugin BuddyPress and LearnPress. We have integrated better message plugin for the chat option in Social Way. So for that, we will go to the dashboard and in the install plugins, you can see that our better message plugin has been installed. So we'll go to the better message and here you will click on this button for importing the settings and just click on OK. So now we can see that we have successfully set our settings. So now we'll go to the preview and in the sidebar menu, you can see that we have our message. So this is the message page and we also have the chat box. So here you have the first option that is the conversation refresh interval. For example, if you set it to one, then when the sender sends the message and the receiver will receive a notification after one minute, you have the same option for the side interval refresh. Then we have the combined view where you will be able to see the list as well as the chat window. So let's go to the preview and check our full screen mode. So if you click here, you will be able to see the full screen mode. If you select it, then the user will be able to maximize the screen. So let's go to the preview and check it. So here you can see that we can maximize our window. Then we have the show my profile button. So this will show your profile on the chat page. So if you go to the preview, here you can see the profile button. So when you go to the messaging option, so first let us just see the preview. So here you can see our messaging window. The first one is a fast start which will immediately start the conversation. Then we also have the disable subject. If you don't want then you can just deselect it. Then we have the other option that is the searching user. So in that we have the option that is search all users. So if you go in the preview you will find uh, that you can search any of the user from here then you also have the option to pin any conversation so for that let's go to the preview and i'm sending a message here to the r on day so here if you click on the three dots you will find that you can pin this conversation on your list then we have the option for the message functions like enable replies allow user to edit message and so on so we'll just go to the preview and check all these functionalities so here you can see that we have the popular services like deleting the text editing the text if you click on edit then you will be allowed to edit the message and you can also delete the message we also have the option for reaction so here you can enable reaction and also enable detailed reaction so by integrating the reaction will go into the integration and here we have the emojis section so just click on that this and here you can find the reactions you can add if you want to so for the preview i will log in as a user and in the message here you can see that the emojis are enabled for the reaction so now when you go into the integration settings you will find the first option that is the buddy press and the buddy pulse so here if you want to select it then you can select show private messages and here you can also give a slug name of your type so in the url it will be shown as whatever you have given so now we have the other two options that is the buddy press friends and the buddy press group so if you want to enable or disable any of the settings here you can do it from here i will just show one that is for mini widget so if i go to my preview and you can see here that we have a mini widget that is the chat box so i will come back to my dashboard and i will just deselect the mini widgets from the friends as well as the group and i will save the changes now if i move back to my site and refresh it you will find that our chat box isn't visible i will again move to the dashboard and set it to default and save the changes then we have the gp integration and the emoji you can change if you want to and here if you see the preview you can see our emojis and gp then again coming to the dashboard we have the mobile settings if you want to change anything you can change but i will let it remain to default then we have the attachment settings so here you can select what are the attachments you want it to be allowed you can also change the format you can also select all the formats that you want in it like we have it for audios videos images documents and all and then i will just save the changes now let's go to the notification setting so here you have different options that you can enable or disable so if you want to enable the browser notification then you can enable it from here 
now we will move to the restriction option and the first option is if you want the user to allow the restriction of any conversation then you can enable it from here then we also have the option that user will be able to see the blocked user so let's go to the preview and here if you click on the settings button then the user will be able to see all the blocks user so in the preview, you can see that the user has the option to delete a conversation. If you want to restrict your user, then you just select this option. Then we have options for sound and calls and groups call. If you want to change anything, then you can, but I'm just making it to default. If you go to the mini widgets, you will have an option where you can add a close button. So in the preview, if you see that in our chat box, we have the close button. If you want to enable it, then just select it. Again, we will move to the dashboard. Then we have the customization option where you can disable the favorite message option if you want to. Then we have other option that is the short codes and tools option. Now I will move to our website and I will just message in our group. So here we have a group that is the animal cracker. So I will just type a random message. And from here you can also see the participant. And now if you click on the message, you will get all the list of the conversation that you have. So in the dashboard, we have the messaging option. So I will just disable the subject and I will enable the user suggestion and I will save the changes. Now if we come to our preview and refresh it, you will see that our suggestion is loading so this will give you the list of all the suggestion of your friends so you don't have to search all and this is how you can customize our settings in the message get started with social media today and start leveraging the power of your knowledge and community